Hey, what's up you guys? You're watching Team APS and in today's video I'm going to be opening three special editions of Clash of Rebellion. So this just came out um, last week and it's kind of just I mean, you know, a reprint of Clash of Rebellions but it's cool because you get some super rare variant cards and it's three packs for ten bucks so it's kind of a better deal if you usually buy blisters. And I'm um, going to open them up, see what we can get. You guys already know some of the valuable cards in this set are things like, what is it, Farm Girl, Luster Pendulum, um, Arch Phoenix Centric, and like Storming Mirror Force is a cool card. So, um, yeah, lots of great stuff. I'm going to go ahead and hop right into this. And um, today it's just me opening alone because unfortunately, you know, my winter break separates me from the twins. But that's okay. I promise I can entertain alone, maybe. So, uh, yeah, these are cool. Got the security sticker thing, make sure no one steals stuff. And, oh, I better check. Uh, the variant cards you can get either Ultima Zulkin or Fright for Tiger, which I think makes Fluffles cheap now, because that was like an exclusive card. And then you can either get uh, one of these variant cards, you know what they are. Anyway, though. Okay, so our variants are Fright for Tiger and Destruction Sword Flash. So that's what it is. Okay, so Fright for Tiger is that Fluffle Fusion that was expensive. This does something with Buster Blader. So the cool Buster Blader support comes out next set. So this probably won't be super useful until then. But uh, anyway, that's our two promo cards. We'll probably move these around. And. We've got our three packs. So, um, you get three of these in each, and I'm probably just gonna go ahead and, you know what, I'll speed this up and just open them all at the same time. Um, or like, you know, one after the other. Okay, so I've opened um, all the packs. Here are the rest of our um, cards. We've got two Ultimized Zulkins, two more Destruction Sword Flashes. It's nice to even get all six cards, but that's okay. Uh, so, cool cards. Now, let's get into our packs. Like I said, I would love to pull Farm Girl, Art Phoenix Center, Luster Pendulum. Uh, three special editions, so we'll hope for like maybe four hollows if we're lucky, but three is probably what we can expect to see. Kyoto Waterfront, that's the Kaiju card. Balance of Judgment, Pianissimo, Perform Age Trick Clown, Crystal Rose, and ooh, super rare in the first pack. Red Eyes Fusion, so for those of you Red Eyes coolies, this is sweet. Um, this card's actually really annoying to me, because I get confused from the deck, which is, makes it a really great top deck, so, uh, yeah, but a few, uh, super in our first pack, looks pretty good. Uh, put the holiday over there, the commons over there, let's leave this up. Cool. Next pack. Red Eyes Fusion is super rare. The only thing I hate about pulling a hollow in my first pack is it means like maybe the next two packs just won't have a hollow. That always sucks. Mystery Shell Dragon Human Winds, Drummerilla, Ignite Squire, DDD Marksman Kingtail, and no hollow. Mm, keep the Shrine, Return of the Red Eyes. I'm not gonna bother with the rares, man. I don't care for them. Next pack though. Anyway, um, you guys might have noticed on my channel, I've been doing a lot of episodes of that Let's Play. I'm trying to just kind of finish it off. Um, I've got all the episodes recorded with the twins, and um, just wanted it to be... Ooh, Toon Cyber Dragon. But no more hollows. Well, for the first one at least. Toon Cyber Dragon's kind of cool though. Looks neat. Yeah, so, I guess it's technically our first special edition down. But yeah, like I was saying with the, um, the Let's Play, I'm going to be pumping out a lot of episodes of that, and I'm also doing like a guest upload week next week. Uh, I don't know if I'll upload the video with the details about that by the time this goes up, but we'll see. Next pack. Perform Age Flame Eater, Trick Clown again, Bread of Paradise Lost, Drummerilla, Toon Cyber Dragon, and oh, another super. Void Imagination, Low Torch, Backup Rider, Retaliating Suit. Kind of neat little side deck card toward the end of the last format, but not quite so relevant anymore. Anyways, Void Imagination is the... Something about, like, Infernoid fusing? I don't know. Cool card, but not necessarily one that I would use much, because I don't use Infernoids. It's 
okay though. We'll just leave it up. It's a super. And uh, I guess this is our second pack of the second special edition. Here's a messy table. Uh, singing Lanius, Secret Blast, Bubble Barrier, Return. Duh. Oh wow. Well, Dragong. I always say that wrong. And Eternally Decatron, so a super. Um, pretty neat. And Stilts Launcher, Aroma Jar, and Blowtorch again. So two supers in a special edition sounds good to me. I'll take what I can get. And then we'll sleeve it up. I guess the idea of getting a secret in one of these is pretty wild. So maybe I am just getting my hopes up a bit. But this will technically be the last pack of the second special edition. So. Secret Blast, Ignite Margrave, Extinction on Schedule, Melodious Diva, Sea Dragons of Draconia, and oh nice, an Ultra Red Wait, so that means we actually got three hollows and three packs. Cards of the Red Stone. Um, this is the Red Eyes draw card where you send a Red Eyes from your hand to the grave and draw two. And uh, then you can send a level so Okay. Sweet. Uh, this is my first special edition I think I've ever opened where I got a hollow in all three packs. I traditionally had horrible luck with special editions, actually. If you've watched some of my ones, like, earlier in the year and, like, last year, I typically would have, like, special editions where I got, like, no, no hollows at all. <laughs> so, all right, we're on our last three packs. Let's see what gold we can get from this. Farm Girl would make my day, but at this point, a Super Rare Luster Pendulum would do. Balance of Judgment, Pianissimo, Trick Clown, Aroma Garden, Perform Age, Trapeze Magician, and No Hollow, the Despot of Five. Trapeze Magician is at least a pretty good Xyz monster. It can net you some cool OTKs if you're about that life. Uh, Ignitus Prominent, and Perform Age guy can do a lot of damage. It's happened to me online. Balance of Judgment, Mystery Shell Dragon, Trick Fox, Flame Eater, Ignite Burst. Darn it. I guess that's our rare. Blow Torch, Fuzzy Lanius, Melodious Diva, and Hat Trigger. So, uh, four hollows so far. So technically we reached our goal, but we'll be greedy. And we'll pray for one more. And our final pack. So this is our last pack. Our destiny draw, I might call it. Clash of Rebellions. Let's see. Aramage Kananga, Raid Raptor Return, Opera the Melodious Diva, Chicken Game, Magical Abductor, and, well, <laughs> it's a super. Dried Winds on um, Backup Rider, Retaliating Sea, and Hat Trigger. So we actually pulled five hollows out of nine packs, which Believe it or not, is despite the hollows being kind of meh, I would say that's actually great ratios. Um, so let's leave this one up, and then we'll do our quick recap. I'm actually really happy with this. I mean, you know, special editions, I've never really been a huge fan of them, but, uh, you know, what can you say? So, uh, recap is a lot of supers and then one ultra, so we'll just do the ultra first. Um, one card to the red stone, red eye support, then dried winds, decatron, void imagination, and red eyes fusion. So not bad for our hollows. Um, and I guess just a quick look at our promo ish. We got two Ultimaya Zulkins, two or actually three destruction flash swords, and a fright for a tiger. So. Not bad. Um, this is actually definitely worth getting if you want to build a deck around that, but for fluffle players, this is probably enough incentive right there. But anyway, that concludes um, my opening of this special edition. Remember guys, uh, check out TCG Player. It's my sponsor. They're really cool. You can get some great deals on cards. And also, um, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter. Sorry, the content's been a bit like weird for the last couple of weeks. I'm kind of just storing my energy for 2015, if you know what I mean. 2016, I'm dumb. 2016, if you know what I mean. And um, 
It'll all get better then, but I'm going to be finishing up the Let's Play, doing some guest uploads for some small channels, kind of giving back. And, um, yeah, it'll be great. So anyways, give the video a thumbs up if you liked it, and that'll be all, so I'll catch you guys later. Bye, guys.